And it's a bit rough though, I went to, uh, the primary school where I went to school is, is just a mess at the moment. They've got like a barbed wire fence around it. And I don't know if that's kept the kids in or out. And they can't, the kids are out of control. It's so bad that the teachers can't teach them anymore. They won't pay attention in class. So in order to grade the kids and work out if they're advancing, is they mark the graffiti on the walls. That's how they do it. So when you walk around on the walls, there's all these ticks and crosses and circles around spelling errors. Uh, you know, they're fixing things like the punctuation. Oh, this word obviously needs an apostrophe. That's obviously short for cannot. Uh, <laughs> that's the sort of place it is. It's pretty rough. We were, we were pretty poor growing up. Like that. We were pretty poor growing up. Though. We were so poor that mum and dad uh, couldn't afford to beat us. Uh, they, they actually had the Salvation Army had to come around once a week to give us a hiding. Um, those tambourines really leave a welt. And, uh, and, and we were so poor that even if we wanted to steal something, we could only shop with home brand. Right? <laughs> and only that was on special. It was, it was pretty hard. But, uh, uh, but, but to my parents' uh, credit, that even though we grew up poor, I never felt deprived. Uh, for example, while the other kids got to play Operation, um, I got to remove my own appendix. So, that was nice. Uh, well, the other kids got bikes for Christmas. Dad gave me bob cutters. <laughs> the gift that keeps on giving. And, uh, that was pretty good. It's pretty, you've got to watch the security around here, though, because, you know, Mum was, uh, uh, was always worried. You know, like, sometimes you like to leave a spare set of keys under a rock in the garden, uh, in case you lock yourself out. So mum would never let us do that. She was always worried that a burglar might find the keys under the rock. I was like, mum, what does a burglar care about the keys when he's got a perfectly good rock? <laughs> <laughs> After all, the keys are only going to get into one house. Uh, <laughs> but mum was a bit like that. She was very safety conscious, you know, because I loved board games, you know, as a kid. I, loved, I wanted to play Scrabble. I loved Scrabble as a kid. I would, would have loved to play Scrabble. Mum would never let us. She's like, oh no, you're not playing Scrabble. Ooh, it's all fun and games till someone loses an eye. <laughs> you can groan, but that's fucking funny, alright? Now, <laughs> there was one board game we were allowed to play, very popular out in Maddington. Uh, it's called Boganopoly. Uh, a very quick game, it's only got the one square, go to jail. <laughs> <laughs> 